Hi everyone, thanks for tuning in. In this video, we will introduce EC Cloud's latest add-on feature, which is Authport. Note that EC Cloud's add-on features are available for all cloud plans, so even if you're on the trial cloud plan, you can still enjoy the benefits brought by them. So what is Authport? When you enable Authport, EC Cloud can now act as a AAA server for your wireless clients. First, authentication. You can control which wireless clients get to access the network by asking them to authenticate themselves. What's appealing about Authport is that you don't need to set up your own authentication server and account database because they're already built into EC Cloud. Second, authorization. Authenticated clients are authorized certain network privileges based on the constraints defined in the service plans. You can define a time constraint, a data constraint, or both. Furthermore, you can also define a device number constraint so that you can limit the number of devices that can share the same account simultaneously. Third, accounting. The cloud will keep track of account usage and all the activities related to Authport so that you can stay on top of things like how much data an account has consumed, user logins, user logouts, and so on. With Authport, wireless clients are authenticated through Captive Portal. Authport also comes with a Captive Portal editor that will make customization of your Captive Portal so much easier. You can simply drag and drop components such as a text box or a YouTube video and just edit the parameters as desired. Then you can save multiple captive portals that you've customized for use. Since EC Cloud also supports independent captive portal setting for each SSID, each SSID can have its own unique captive portal. So let's talk about how Authport actually works. Once you've enabled Authport on EC Cloud, you can create service plans and generate accounts under these plans. Then you will decide for which SSIDs you want to enable Authport and select the appropriate captive portals. You can then distribute the accounts to your wireless clients so they can use these accounts to log in through captive portal. Once they're authenticated, their network usage will be governed by the service plans associated with their accounts. And as an IT administrator, you will be able to manage the accounts and check their status in real time on EC Cloud. What's more, Authport supports Layer 3 roaming. By this, we mean that when a wireless client has been authenticated by Authport, it can move anywhere within this cloud and still remain logged in. So that's all to this video. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact us at ecwifi at edge-core.com. Have a nice day, and we hope to see you again soon.